graphics card is in the secondary PCI Express slot. And he put it there because the heat sink for the M.2 drives stick up too much and he said he couldn't make it fit in that slot. So the graphics card fits fine. I think he didn't know what to do with the plates and the screw heads that were in the way. So this guy had trouble mounting the CPU cooler to the motherboard. And this plate has to go in and behind here. It does look that way. Yeah, the entire top plate's got to come off. I mean, the fan's got to come out. Oh, wait a minute. You know what I'm just realizing, too? Is the, um... The mounting brackets need to be rotated, I think. So these need to be rotated and moved. Spread it on. Spread it on. <laughs> These screws are for, for the screwdriver to connect this cooler to the motherboard. So the fan here needs to get slid out and these two screws come off and then we can slide our screwdriver down inside. That'll slide down inside here, and then we can tighten it like that. Yeah, now that it's in, I, I think we'll have trouble getting the fan back in. We'll have to take out the graphics card and slide the fan back in. <laughs> I think you might be right. <clears throat> and we also got to think about the orientation of the cable because it's got to hit that top pin, that top spot.
Gen 3, which is Gen 4 slot, so the motherboard doesn't recognize. 